Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Anastasia and now it is time to share my favorite nail products I tried and tested and worked with during this summer. So let's begin! First one is the case for the brushes. I already had a similar one but this is my old one. You can see it's a lot smaller and this one is deeper and it's really nice for traveling for transportation of the brushes and as you can see there are like only eight sockets for the brushes but it's pretty deep so you can put way more brushes there and also what I like about this stuff it's this thing here which will save your bristles next thing is also a case but for the stamping plates and I really like this album I'm sorry it's it's not very clean and it's a nice light pink color very girly and you can keep all your stamp plates here and yes unfortunately some of the plates that I have they're bigger than this album but most of them fit in like my U London for example and I also really like um, this package of the Mayu London I really don't feel like throwing them away and that's why I place them here as well and also like I have different ones here and for example this Conant stamping plates and Elka Raisin they're rounded and they're small but still they can fit in here and it's really nice because you, you know you can immediately see what's in there and it's just really nice and convenient way of keeping your stamping plates in order. Another product that I really like is Polygel and honestly I liked all of them. White, clear and cover pink and I already have a couple tutorials on my channel. I will leave the links to these videos and also a pink and white and long clear nail tutorial with the poly gel is coming up these were highly requested videos and I made them for you and what I can say this is a really great product it's so easy and fast to work with the only advice I already mentioned it in my videos I prefer to work with another brush not the one that comes in the kit but all the rest is really great about this product it's been four weeks I tested it on myself on a couple clients so no lifting no cracks nothing and I really think it's great and we decided to start teaching it at our school because it's just an alternative to gel and acrylic and also nail technicians who used to work with acrylic and gel I think they also would like to try this one and if you are a beginner and if you don't know how to work with acrylic or gel yet I think I think you will still like it another great product I found this is the small LED light and I don't have a battery now inside but you just need to push this button and cure and this will not completely cure gel polish or gel because it's not powerful enough but when you need to freeze cure some design you know when you're doing some design some small drawing and you like want to freeze it it's really great because you don't need to waste time on putting the hand in the lamp it's also great for tutorials for working in the show so for me this is really great tool and I am definitely gonna use it a lot especially during my travels you've probably seen me using this a lot so this is basically just you know an album of papers and this paper it's a little bit shiny it's like the same as paper from the forms but we have them uh, here in stock it's by dense legend so you see this is already used one this is another one I'm using so how to use it you just put drops of gel or gel polish or anything you're working with and then you just tear away the paper and throw it away it's really nice I like it a lot better rather than I was using foil because it reflects the light and you know your eyes it hurts so bad after a whole day of working and another palettes which are plastic or glass they're also nice but you need to clean them all the time and here you just throw it away really great really like nice tool for nail artists another great thing is the buffer and well I can't say it's like great but what I like about it is the color it's light gray it's no name so I have no idea what brand it is and 
this is supposed to be a single-use buffer. When we prep natural nails for gel polish, we buff the natural nails and you know it's not good to use the same file on another client, even if you disinfect it. As you know, some of the bacteria will still live in there. So this is pretty cheap and it's good to use it just for one time and then you can give it to the client or throw it away. Another buffer and first time I saw it, I thought it's like a candy, like Japanese candy or something, but it's not. It's also a buffer and as you can see, it's tiny. And it's also a single use buffer when you prep the nail and throw it away. And both buffers I got as a present from my friend Alexei. So unfortunately, I can't share the link, but once I find it somewhere online, I will definitely share it with you. It's just really great because it doesn't cost a lot. And like I said, I really believe that prepping files for the natural nails should be single use and this is an option. Before we found these buffers, what I used to do, I was just taking a regular long buffer and cutting it into few like slices, like making five or six of them. And you can do the same and to make them a single use. Now it's time to shine. So these are hollow flakes and honestly, I can look at them for a long time. I had a live stream where I showed you how to use them. Also I have a video with a tutorial on how to use them when you need to retouch your nails. And besides hollow, I have silver and also they have many other colors. And I really like these flakes. They shine so well. And I think clients who like glitter and anything that sparkles will definitely love them. Another product for sparkle lovers is the foil. And what's great about it is you can see there's the color ombre on it and it's also sparkling and tutorial how to work with this foil and what can you do with this will be coming up on my channel soon so make sure you subscribe so you will not miss it also among the latest trends i really like this laser hollow stripes i don't really know the right name for them so this is one is golden and this one is silver but they're all hollow and also i have a tutorial of how to use these stripes on my channel coming up i tried it together with the poly gel clear and it looks amazing you know when i did my nail using this foil like almost everybody down the street paid attention to my nails and they were like, oh my God, you have such a great nail. So if you have clients who are like, I want everybody to look on my nails, well, this is a great option for it. And the last product is also nail art. These are pearl flat backs. As you can see, they're silver, yellow, white, and dark silver. They're really great for coming together with some design or you just can use them only on the nail. I used yellow pearl here. It's really great for creating any kind of rhinestones or diamond settings. And also you can just only use them on the nail. And also they look great when they come together with a seashell design, which is also coming up on my channel soon. These were my summer favorites 2017. And if you guys recently tried any products and you liked and you want to suggest me to try them also, please share them in the comments. And if you are all into nail art just like me, consider subscribing. As on my channel, I share nail art tutorials, tips and tricks and different secrets of nail tech life. So thank you very much for watching my video and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.